We're at the starting point of the Kanaten Creek Trail. It's only 11 miles long. Don't know how much time we have for it today, but we'll see how far we get. You'll find the Kanaten Creek Trail south of Akron, Ohio, and west of Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Once the corridor of the Wheeling and Lake Erie Railway, today the 11.2 mile Kanaten Creek Trail is northeastern Ohio at its best. At one time, the line was used to transport iron ore from Great Lakes ports to the steel mills of the Ohio River Valley and haul coal mined from Harrison County to markets in all directions. The highlight of the trail, and one of the reasons we chose it, were the five covered bridges. trail is a beautifully paved, straight, easy trail with wonderful swampy water views on one side. I think it's supposed to be what's left of the river on the other. It's a wonderful morning and we've seen one of the covered bridges. Hopefully we'll catch another one. Here we are at the end of our ride. Um, we didn't have as much time to spend on this trail as we'd have liked, but this is a very nice trail. Oh, it is. It's fresh pavement, and you can ride right along at a, at a good pace. As you said, unfortunately, we weren't able to make it to the end, but saw a few covered bridges, some animals, and even a beaver dam. And it didn't. we did not get to the end because we couldn't ride 11 miles one way. We have <laughs> someplace else we have to be, and time is not uh, going to allow us to finish this trail. But hopefully you have enough to know what it's all about. Well, we're going to take a break from biking and go to the wilds. It's on the way to our next stop, Columbus, and it's going to give me the opportunity to go and stay in a yurt. Randy humors my need to stay in weird places. I saw this yurt online and we just had to do it.
I thought our yurt was in one of the best locations. We were right on the edge, we had great views, and it was really wonderful and peaceful. Well, that's it for this adventure. Hope to see you on the next one.